Grace House is a shelter for women who are 17 and older. The shelter can also work with transgender women. The house can hold up to 13 people. Women can stay for 90 days to stabilize and help them rebuild their lives. Grace is the house pet. She's considered part of the house and she also helps with the women. From the money to the renovations, everything in the house is possible because of volunteers. Executive director of the Fredericton Homeless Shelters, Warren Maddox, said it's always started with help from the J.D. Clark Family Foundation. Um, so it took us about uh, six months to, to get the additional 40000 in play. And uh, then we went back to uh, the foundation in September and said, we got her. And uh, the, uh, they looked down through our, our list of, of people that had donated and they said, yep, you do have it. So they uh, said, good. And uh, they cut us a check for 40000 plus the 41000 that we had raised. Uh, gave us $80,000 and we've had some additional funding come in since then. So the project is, is completely funded at this point. Manager Prashma GC is one of the five people staff at Grace House. She says this project is a great example of how a community can help. There are a few upgrades in the new house which I'm excited about. Uh, like Warren mentioned, there will be uh, more space in terms of uh, we, will, we will have more storage for donations, which we re really lack over here. We will have more space for staff. Um, we will have more bathrooms, which is, uh, which is really great because once we are full, when we have like 10 residents in the house, it's, uh, it gets really hectic. The renovations started on July and are expected to be ready next month. The new house will accommodate the same number of people, but you also have a resource library and a computer room. For us to journalism, Fernanda Damiani reports.